Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. For this video, I want to share to you guys how I bypass this iPhone X, um, which is on the Hello screen. So this is a iCloud, i uh, iCloud issue device, and the problem with this is it is running iOS 15, so it doesn't support jailbreak. So now let me show you guys how I bypass this device, so we can use this as a normal iPhone 10 as if it, do it doesn't have an iCloud account. So let's go. First, let me show you the device information. So this is the iPhone 10. This is a 256GB unit. And as you can see, it is not activated but the iCloud is turned on. So we cannot activate this without the old Apple ID that has been used to activate this device. So the only thing that um, uh, we can do for this phone right now is to bypass it and now guys we are, we are going to do, to update or restore the device to the um, latest version iOS latest version which is iOS 15.4.5 something so any latest iOS should work uh, we are do we are going to do this just um, just to make sure that uh, after we bypass this device, we have the latest version of the iOS 15. So after downloading the firmware, we are going to flash this device. Flash complete, so we are going to boot now on my Mac OS. Now that I am on my Mac OS, we are going to use this bypasser RAM disk AIO 2.7 although this is a bit old um, soft or version you can download the latest one today as of now I don't know what is the latest one but and also you can use another tools um, uh, that is somehow like this I bypass or RAM disk we have another we have a lot of options to use we have a lot of softwares to use on the community right now but for this video I'm going to use this iBypass or RAM disk AIO 2.7 so the method is so easy because everything that we need to do is on the software itself so the application will tell you the next steps that you're going to do in order to bypass your device so let's just follow the instructions First, we need to boot into DFU mode. So, to do that, we need to plug our iPhone X into the Mac and do the button combinations. So, after that, uh, our iPhone should stay on black screen and the iTunes should pop up saying that our, that our phone is now on recovery mode it is an indication that your phone now that your phone now is successfully booted into DFU now let's click purple mode and let's wait until our device enter the purple mode sometimes you should you will take a lot of times or retry try to enter the purple mode most of the time you will fail but eventually your phone will enter DFU mode in few tries Oh okay, guys, so in, in my case, I am stuck on 80% and the tool is asking me to plug in a DCST cable. So this is a uh, serial writing cable for iPhone and iPad. So fortunately, I have this kind of cable, but still I tried not to use it because the developer itself says that this supports um, an ordinary cable. But I don't know what's the problem with this, but... I can't bypass my device using my ordinary lightning cable so luckily I have my uh, DCST cable so I am going to use this right now okay so I will going to click the use DST cable or DCST cable and let's wait until the software do its job so guys I have tried this process but as you can see it says success but the phone itself is not booting into purple mode so 
I guess I have encountered a problem and when it comes to this magic CFG as you can see right now the details of our device is not appearing on the magic CFG so let's find what's the problem so okay guys I have now booted into the purple mode so what I did is that I manually enter the DFU mode so I do I didn't use the I bypasser RAM disk AIO so I uh, booted manually using the magic CFG and my DCSD cable so right now I am in purple mode although the screen of my iPhone is green not actually purple but green so as you can see I have here the serial number and what we are going to do right now is to change it into the provided serial number by the uh, developer of this iBypasser software so now I'm going to rewrite and change the serial number of this device so after rewriting I will going to disconnect and reconnect and check if it is um, rewritten so as you can see it is rewritten and now let's go to boot device 2 so guys I decided to repeat all the process before I continue so that you it will be easy for you to follow first we need to enter the, the recovery mode and using this I bypass around this we're going to boot to click boot DFU and another window will pop up and this time we're going to click this and start and let's just follow the instructions until we boot into the DFU mode so there is the thing that will the software itself will boot our device into a proper DFU now that we are in DFU mode the next thing we should do now is to uh, we, need, we need not to follow the software but follow my tricks so open the magic CFG this is a free software from magic CFG and look for your device serial or port if you can't find your serial just click here on the upper part the enter diag mode button so just click it and something will pop up this is the diag uh, the digitizer DBU what do you call this one I don't know and then just uh, click enable and let's use this thing for us to put our device into the diagnostic mode so for this process we need to change our regular cable into DCSD cable so as you can see I am changing the lightning cable into the DCSD cable so after putting the DCSD cable as you can see we can now click this logo right here in the digitizer DBU so as you can see it says exploiting sending IBSS and let's just wait until our device boot into purple mode sending image and then it says it's done so this tool is very very helpful for these processes so as you can see our screen now is stuck on the on the most green <laughs> screen actually but we call this as purple even though it is not purple so now we can add uh, so now we can see that our serial is already appeared here on the magic cfg it has appeared on the magic cfg software so we just need to select that serial port and read ccfg click the button read, read CCFG and for this time we are going to change the serial number into the given serial number by the developer of this iBypasser software it is important for us to bypass the device because without it we cannot um, skip the activation bypass or oh, activation screen sorry so as you can see I already written it a while ago I just showing you that it is working now that we have changed our serial number we can now we can now proceed into the next steps the next step is we are going to change back into the regular regular lightning cable and we are going to reboot our device into normal mode and we are going to repeat the process let's go boot to recovery and then using the tool let's boot into DFU 
But this time, after booting into DFU, we are going to skip the purple mode and uh, we are going to click the boot device button besides that purple mode button. We don't need to do that anymore because we already changed the serial number of this device. We already have manually entered the purple mode as a while ago as I, as I show you guys. So let's wait until the software do its job. As all you know guys, after our, re our first try with this tool, we are stuck on 80% and it says successful even though not. So now we have skipped the 80% and we are now on the 95%, 97, 98, 99, and Charan successful 100%. Now the tower device is booted up. We just need to wait until it is fully boot up and uh, we're going to activate it as normal. And this time we can now um, skip the activation. And now guys, we have successfully bypassed our iPhone X. So we can now use this as normal for gaming, for social media, everything. You can also log in using your iCloud account in this um, particular iPhone. So thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Also guys, I am going to change or replace the LCD of this device and I have another review for the LCD that I will going to bought so make sure to be uh, make sure to click the bell icon for post notifications for updates for my upcoming videos so thanks for watching please 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 like and subscribe bye bye everyone and God bless see you around